Hi everyone, this is Tommy from Studio Ultra Mega with another Operation Battle Ready tutorial. Episode 22, Edge Highlighting and Painting Guns. Before we start painting today, we need to talk a little bit about edge highlighting. Normally when we paint, we like to use the nice sharp tips of our brushes, but with edge highlighting, we're actually going down the side of the brush a little bit to use its flat edge. Then with well thinned paint, you just run that flat edge along a hard edge of the model, and it should drag that paint right along the nice crisp edge there and make a really clean highlight. We're going to start by base coating the gun with graphene gray. And when we're doing this, we're not just going to slop it all over. We're going to take great care to leave uh, all the depressions and creases and deep parts of the gun black. Anywhere where there's a stepped difference in the elevation of the surface, we're going to make sure that that side edge there is black too. So essentially everything's being black lined while we do our base coat. Now we can start building up our highlights. Uh, the first layer of highlights is going to be uh, about a two parts graphene gray, one part graphite mix. This first layer of highlights is a broad highlight and we definitely want this to blend into the graphene gray that's already there. So you can see on the uh, wider, more open areas, uh, I'm just kind of feathering that in from the hard edge. I'm also making sure to favor, and you'll see as this model progresses, um, as the highlights gradually get brighter they also start to favor the skyward edges of the gun. Um, I always assume a general overhead light source uh, for my models unless I'm creating a special direction for the model. Um, so you see there, I'm dragging that right down that flat panel and making nice soft feathery blends there and that's also about the same consistency you want to edge highlight with the same consistency of paint that you would uh, feather in a blend with. This next highlight color is uh, the opposite ratio with the two same colors. It's going to be one part graphene gray and two parts graphite.
As we progress through successive layers of highlights, we make each one brighter and tighter than the previous one, always favoring the skyward edges. This next successive layer of highlighting is the exact same color. I have the previous layer on so thin uh, that just by doing the exact same color over again we, we create a brighter tone. Uh, so this is the exact same color, we're just treating it as a brighter color as far as coverage. So it's an uh, extra little step in there uh, without even needing a new mix. This next layer of highlight is the pure graphite and again we are favoring the skyward facing edges and corners. Now we're beginning a layer of a mix of graphite and Reaper's Misty Gray. And the ratio here is about 60-40, uh, with the 40 being the Misty Gray. The final highlight step is pure misty gray and I'm really being conservative with it. I'm only hitting it on the extreme corners and most skyward edges and it's also very very thin and I'm really really lightly feathering it in. Cannot stress enough that as the highlights get brighter, we keep those areas of coverage tighter, closer to edges, and uh, higher up on corners. We do not fully outline each piece of the weapon.
highlights done, I take an opportunity here to uh, touch up the black recesses and such with some very thinned out black. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, and I'd like to thank all our patrons at Patreon that make these videos possible. See y'all next episode.